Carsten from Denmark. Uh, you asking what bird would I really like to see that I have? Leopard, leopard, everyone, look here. Here we go, right in front of us. <laughs> what? A, <laughs> how's that? Wow, this looks like a big male. I wonder if this isn't Tingana. Let's have a look. I think it's him. I think it's him. Let's see, he might be moving down into this drainage line. It's really warm for a leopard to be moving around. I'm so surprised. Okay, let's see. Let's see where he's going. Well, there we go. How is that? <laughs> I'm just trying to have a look and see if we can follow him. He might, uh, hopefully he doesn't disappear down and lie right in the drainage. He's just in front of us. Have a look, he's moving down there. He might decide to find some shade. And Texan, Texan, do you copy? Um, um, for we've just located a male leopard over here. Um, if you want to come in from that side, you might get visual. Yeah, FM is actually just come out the drainage line. So come in directly where you are and you should get a view from there and maybe you can stick with him. I see I'm just letting Taxon Hold on, you can see him moving there. Um Um this is going to be difficult for us to move through here. Hold on, I'm going to get back onto the road. Yeah, James, you say it is Tingana, as I, I thought so. Sorry, I'm just trying to multitask here a little bit. Let me get out of here. I don't want to lose that leopard now. Sorry, he sends it. There he is, I still see him, I still see him. Well, luckily, the other guide is on the other side of the drainage line. There he is, there he is. Now, I wonder if he's potentially hunting. Have a look, there he is. What a nice surprise for this afternoon. We've been very lucky the last last few days with um, with predators and this is definitely one of This is definitely one of my favorite leopards, I must be honest. It's just something about seeing a big tom like this. <laughs> and all of you sound very excited to see leopard so you see things happen for a reason maybe if we didn't have those technical issues earlier we wouldn't have been able to follow him or we wouldn't have found him rather we would have we would have driven past him who knows he's gonna come out in front of us look here there he comes As I said, it's very strange that he's moving during the heat of the day. It just shows you, everyone, often people say, well, leopards don't move around during the day. Well, this is, this is a, a clear indication that they do. They'll move around whenever they want. If they're hungry or thirsty or possibly just trying to find a new, new area. He's going into an even thicker spot. I think, um, I think I'm going to stick on this side of the drainage. It just works out if we work as a team. There's Texans on the other side. Um, 
and he will be able to then follow him from that side if he sticks that side and I can follow him from this side in case he crosses back through again but I wonder if he hasn't laid down now I don't see him moving is he still there standing now I'll just have a look and see oh this is really exciting i'm going to stick with this leopard and see where he goes hopefully he settles down for us but let's go across to james who apparently has some lions in the mara <laughs> 